Hi, I'm Emmanuel Rose from Strategic E-Marketing. Today about the three biggest mistakes I see in failed marketing campaigns with prospects and clients. The biggest mistake is the first one, which is there's a lack of a plan for previous campaigns. So uh, a marketing plan is pretty straightforward. It um, is comprised of a few very specific parts. Number one, establishing what the goals are, what the KPIs are, key performance indicators, um, how many uh, people do I want to reach, how many prospects uh, am I going to uh, need to see, a prospect being defined as somebody who's shown interest, open of an email, a click of a link, uh, a form fill, a phone call. How many of those people do I need in order to uh, make the number of sales necessary to uh, hit the growth numbers? So those are all KPIs that should be tracked. Um, also in a plan is establishing who the target audiences are. And a lot of times I see people just say, well, we made these offers and the offers uh, didn't get taken up on. Well, it's a big marketplace now that's very, very niched or stratified. Uh, you're going to need to identify who you're talking to by demographics, which is age, gender, uh, stage of life. And then by the psychographics, which is the way that they're making their decisions um, in re relation to your offer. So we need to establish those target audiences and then plan on which tactics you're going to use in order to contact each of those target audiences. Establish uh, a timeline of, and a, a beginning, middle, and end of the campaign. And... And then es establish a budget. So uh, there's oftentimes there's not uh, a budget that says, if I'm going to spend this much money, I want to get this many dollars in sales out of this uh, out of this campaign. So that's the first big problem is a lack of a plan with the goals, target audience, marketing tactics, timeline and budget. The, the second massive error I see is um, in addition to not establishing uh, niched target markets, um, clients and prospects are not modifying the content, the emails, the landing pages, the webinars to match each target market. So if you are targeting female executives who are early in their career, they need different content than older male executives because of the way that um, they're seeing the world, making decisions. And so we, we have core content, and then we have this modified content in order to match the personas. So that's the second big mistake that I see is that uh, people are just sending out the same material no matter uh, which persona it is. And, and then the third big mistake that I see with my clients and prospects is that they're um, either not uh, setting time to review the progress in, of the campaign in, in terms of what are the KPIs. Um, they're, they're not doing that or they're doing it superficially and, and not modifying uh, the campaign in the middle. So this, uh, by, by not reviewing KPIs, then you're dooming your campaign to uh, lackluster performance because it's a very uh, rare campaign that's perfect right out of the box from the starting date. Uh, nobody's smarter than the market not your CMO, not your marketing consultant, not me. And so we have to take what our original goals were 
and compare our activity and our success up to these milestone dates and make modifications in order to get better results. So those are the three biggest mistakes I see in campaign development for in marketing. Uh, if I missed some, please put it in, uh, in the comments or DM me. It's Manny's Marketing Minute. Get out there and sell something.